So, if you haven't read either of them, them books, we, we speak English on this channel. Hey guys, it's Jay, and today I am here with the Fall Time Cozy Time book tag. This was originally created by Sam over at Novels and Nonsense. I was actually tagged by four people. I was tagged by the creator Sam, Bitten by a Radioactive Book, Miss Book Lover, and Britney's Book Find. So I will leave all of their links down below if you want to check them all out, and I will leave Sam's original video down below as well. So without further ado, let us get started! I'm just going to read the questions off my phone because they're actually pretty long and your girl forgetful. So the first question is Crunching Leaves and it is The world is full of colors. Choose a book that has red, oranges, and yellows on the cover. I actually found one with all three colors. I was very proud of myself, I'm just saying. And it is John Fix by Jason Squire Fluck. Still love his last name. Have I read this book yet? No, I know. I'm very behind on things that I'm supposed to do. But Red, orange, yellow. Boom! Challenge completed. The next question is Cozy Sweater. It's finally cool enough to don warm cozy clothing. What book gives you the warm fuzzies? And I am saying Anna and the French Kiss by Stephanie Perkins. I just love this book and it just gives me warm fuzzies because I've always wanted to go to Paris so while I was reading it I was just like... One day I will get there. Hopefully. Probably not because you go broke, but maybe when I'm like 80 and retired, we'll go to Paris. The next question is Fall Storm, and it is The Wind is Howling and the Rain is Pounding. Choose your favorite book or genre that you like to read on a stormy day. My favorite genre to read on a stormy day is thriller. It's basically my favorite genre to read all the time, but I feel like when it's like gross outside, thrillers just make it so much better. And you get more into the story because it's like everything's so depressing outside. So then you're like, I must solve this mystery. Maybe it's just me. I don't know, but I love them. Next is Cool Crisp Air, and the question is, what is the coolest character you'd want to trade places with? I would want to trade places with Magnus Bane from the Mortal Instruments, Infernal Devices, and the Bane Chronicles by Cassandra Clare, because I just think having all that magic would be so cool. I might want to just trade places with Alex so I could just hang out with Magnus all the time. haven't really decided which one I would prefer. Next question is Hot Apple Cider. What underhype book do you want to see become the next biggest thing? I have two for this. If you've been on my channel for a while, you can probably call what these two books are. The first one is Daddy by PJ Ferguson. This book follows a man named Joe Williams, and basically he needs to rely on 12 jury members to either serve justice for his family or not, and I just really love this book. I love the author. And just nobody's heard of this book, nobody's read the book that I know of. I haven't had anybody tell me they've actually read it, but I think it's so good. And just if you have the opportunity to read it, I would highly recommend it. And then my second book for this, you can probably all call it as well, and it is The Magician by D.A. Poopa. I also love this book. Nobody has read this book that I know of. It's about a serial killer and a investigating P.I. The P.I.'s name is Frank and it's basically him trying to catch this serial killer before it's too late and it's just such a good book and he's coming out with a sequel and I am so excited because it's coming out like super soon and I need it in my possession and also this cover is just super pretty. I would highly recommend them both so you should read them. The next question is coat scarves and mittens the weather has turned cold and it's time to cover up what's the most embarrassing book cover you own that you like to keep hidden in public okay see here's the thing i don't really care that much about covers like i'm gonna read what i'm gonna read and if people don't like it deal with it but i would say that a lot of new adult covers are pretty embarrassing like for example i found one on my shelf that i'm like ooh, i don't know if i would want to be on like a public transportation or something with this book out and it is Death by Sex Puppet by Dick and December Bouvier. You know, it might be a little weird to be sitting there like, Hey, children, do you like my sex puppet book? It's not about sex puppets. It's completely different than the title says. But, you know, people judge very easily. So, might want to, you know, read it like this so nobody can see. Next is Pumpkin Spice. And you have to say what your favorite fall time comfort food or foods are. See, I don't really have comfort food. I just eat everything in my pathway. So, um, I'm just gonna tell you my favorite foods that my mom makes because I don't get those when I'm at school. So. Um, she makes homemade spaghetti with like spaghetti sauce that she makes and it's so good. It's like super 
meaty and mushroomy and I love mushrooms so it's just a great time and I really like her french toast love french toast so good I don't really have full comfort foods because I just consume all the food all the time so yes and the final one is warm cozy bonfire spread cozy warmth who do you tag I tag everybody who's watching this video so make the video all right guys so that was the full time cozy time book tag I will see you all in my next video Goodbye!